high. My senior sermon back in 1992 was based on Parashat Vayigash. It's a beautiful Torah portion. It's the Torah portion of the encounter between Joseph and his brothers. It's a moment of revelation. It's a moment of emotion. Joseph gathers, orders Benjamin to remain with him, but then gathers his entire family, his entire siblings around him and says, Ani Yosef, I'm Joseph. And then immediately says, Haod Abichai, is my father still living? And it's such an emotional moment. I, back then in 92, I was putting together the theory that Joseph was not just revealing himself to his brothers because he had changed so much, but he was also rhetorically saying, is my father still alive in me? Not my father in terms of the relationship, but my father in terms of the traditions, the Judaism, the Israelism that he had learned from him. Have I converted to this Egyptian society? Am I too assimilated? Or I still keep those traditions with me? And that was the whole essence of my senior sermon. And I think that's still valid as a concept. Joseph coming back with his brothers is going back in the past. How he and the brothers are going to manage this new, this encounter in the new society they're going to live in. They're going to settle in the land of Goshen, a nice place according to tradition. And the people of Israel are going to live there for 400 years. It is only at the very end of that period that we see a new Pharaoh coming on board. Joseph is already being dead for a long time. And we see then the suffering of the people of Israel as they will become enslaved. And that will be the thrust and theme of the next book, the book of Exodus. So we have one more parasha to go, Parashat Vayechi, and conclude this life of the patriarchs and their children. So this incredible encounter, affectionate with the brothers and late even more emotional with his own father, Yaakov, still living, allows the Israelites to have an entry into the society of Egypt as Pharaoh recognizes Joseph as so important and wise, but also his family. The Israelites will dwell in that place of Goshen and they will increase in numbers and in possessions and they will be a prosperous people. That is, in, in a short uh, words, what Parashat Vayikash is. I will hope to see you on, on Zoom Friday night and if you sign up to be on Shabbat morning, all the more so, fantastic to see you in person. Uh, and then we'll have Kiddush to go, I believe, and have a wonderful time together. All right, Shabbat Shalom. Bye-bye.